I'm going to try to get to some pass stuff, and I'll go through it real quick. All right, so pass game, all right? And I'll, I'll get to this real – I'm going to try to get through it quickly as possible, right? But for us, pass game is very simple, right? For me, it's three components to a pass rush, right? And how I teach pass rush, there's three components, right? Everything starts with speed with us. Everything we're going to do is speed, right? We're going to run every rush with speed. Right? There ain't no other thing that we teach other than speed to start the pass rush. If you ain't beating with speed to, try, to start, then you're wrong. All right? So what we talk about speed, we want to beat a guy to a spot. So I say, hey, you see that spot on the floor? Right? Everybody has to pick a spot. Right? I'm beating him there. Right? We want to beat him to a spot. We talk about it all the time. Right? Get on his shoulders, beat him to a spot. Right? Then we talk about what's next. What's next? Well, I didn't beat him to a spot. Well, now if he's even. Right? If he's even with me, he's taking a good set, right? They get coached too, right? Where it's good offensive linemen. They get paid a lot of money, right? We talk about now we want to turn that into a bull rush, right? If he's even with me, I want to walk the old lineman back with power, right? I want to get into him and start to walk his back, right? Because if I ain't beat him with speed, chances are I'm at the point in the pocket where I need to start to collapse it. So get him with speed and push his ass back, right? Then there's the overset, right? So now he oversets me. Well, now I'm going to win with an inside move. I'm going to counter back. I'm going to have some type of counter. I don't give it. We talk about a cage, and you'll see that here in a second here, right, and how we talk about pass rush and defining getting the guys in cages, right? There, I don't tell guys, you got to stay outside. You got to stay inside. No, I tell them you got to fucking win, right? Win, 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 right? We want guys that want to fucking win. Win the guy pass rush, right? If you went inside, you went inside, right? If you went outside, you went outside, right? But what we do teach, right, we tell those guys, right, that there's different, there's different components to the pass rush. Well, hey, this is the cage. This is how we fix the cage when we didn't win this way, right? We talk about protections, right? The guys have to understand what the protections are, right? We talk about half slide protections, right? We talk about full slides, and we talk about bob protections, man on man, right? So the guys have to understand those and know those, right? You heard me talk about the cage. This is probably one of the most important things we do, and we drill the of this all the time, right? So when I talk about I don't care how you win, you win it, right? If I'm, if I'm these, we, we talk about how, who works together, right? And how we think about it. Well, the A and the N work together, can work together. The A and the B can work together, right? Or the N and the E can work together, right? That means if I'm the, if I'm the N and I'm pass rushing inside and I see the E cross my face, guess what I need to do? I need to go back outside. Right, because he's taking over my pass rush lane. Right, if I'm the in, right, and I go across the A space, guess what the A needs to do? Come back around. Right, we're gonna win. Right, we're gonna win at all costs. We're gonna sell out in pass rush. Right, well, how does that work? Well, it worked that we had over 30 sacks this year. Right, and then you just and you can watch us just one on one pass rush. Right, and we should win with we should all it should all be speed to start out with. Right. Speed, right? Just get off the ball. How fast can we do it, right? And it doesn't matter. Everybody gets taught the same way. Don't matter if you're an interior, outside guy, everyone's getting taught the same way, right? Boom. Beat him with speed. Beat him with speed. All speed. Right? I'm beating him. Everybody's trying to beat him to a spot. Can I get off the ball faster than he can get up out of his stance? Right? And now, you get the overset. What do you do? Counter. Right? Violent hands. Beat him with speed. Right? He don't want to turn that outside leg and open it up for me because he's protecting the inside because he don't want us to go. Well, beat his ass with speed. I guarantee you the next time he opens his ass up. Right? Get on his edge. Right? We talk about this. Lean into his ass. Right? Because when you lean into him, guess what they're going to do to you? Right? Is this as good as a sack? Right? That's a fucking sack to us. Right? If you hold me on third down and 10, right, and we get third down and 20, no, we decline it, fucking punt it. Right? That's a an outside guy going inside now. Win with speed. Well, now he's shitting his pants because he's got an in on him, so now he's going to go out fast. Okay. 
Counter. See if we can get some game tape for you. Or here, some more practice. All right? And talk about, hey, what, we don't tell them where to go. Watch them. All right? And we're getting in hell everywhere. Watch them. All speed. All right? The guy who ends up on the outside, too. All right? That's the interior pass rusher. Chasing them down. All right? Let me see how well we're coaching. Let me see how many guys are running. All right? You want to talk about a standard, what the standard is? Right here. D lineman, D lineman, D lineman, D lineman. Right? Make them live the standard. Right? Speed. Speed. Right? Do all, do all pressures result in sacks? No. Right? We talk about getting the quarterback off his spot, incompletions, interceptions, right? Any takeaway, anything off the spot that causes them a negative play is a win. All right? Just walk him now. Speed. He, now he just got to go straight power, walk his ass back. Right? Speed on the outside here. Get him to stop his feet and don't go. Right? Cause negative plays. Right? Second and nine. He's thinking pass. Right? I won't chew him for this, right? Because in my head, now he's a thinking man. It's second and nine. They're behind the sticks. They got to they gotta throw the football. Just be fast. All right, and you watch 92 here. Oh, something's wrong. Let me get back outside. Fix the cage. All right? We always, you know, we always hear some thoughts, right? Things that we tell them at the end, right? This is always my thing I, I tell them at the end, right? Success lies in how good they want to be, right? You know? I stole this from the Dallas Cowboys. I had a chance to be in that camp a uh, few years back, right? It was on the wall. I thought it was a pretty good quote, right? It says, we must prepare every day to be successful, right? Right, right, right as you go out to, to uh, the practice field, right? It says, a man who uh, fails to prepare must prepare himself for failure, right? Always talk about mistakes happening. Don't compound them with bad attitudes, right? Bad attitudes, take your ass back inside and come back out when you're ready to go, right? You'll be coached hard, right? They're going to receive praise. Coach them hard. Right? That's the biggest fucking lie in the world that says people don't want to be coached hard. That's a cop out. That's the biggest coach's cop out. That's the biggest parent cop out. Right? That's a cop out for people who don't want to work hard. Right? Coach them hard. You just got to love them up. Right? And that doesn't mean go out and dog cuss a kid. You can't just go dog cuss somebody. But once you've gained their trust, right? Once you've shown that you're willing to fall on the grenade for them, they'll fall on it for you. Right? Coach them hard. Right? I always tell them, right? Hear the message, not the tone. Understanding situational football and our thing, right, at Lake Forest is rock standard, right? We got a big, giant-ass rock outside, uh, right? Every championship team get, gets, gets their uh, year put up there, right? Right? We want to live to that standard. Play to what our standard is, right? You know, play with a motor, have fun. They chose a quote. It was a J.J. Watt quote. Um, but that's all I got. I appreciate you guys.